Okay, today we have Mike with his uh, motorcycle. We're going to do a lithium battery replacement. Mike, tell us about this bike. What is it? It's a Suzuki JS6R1000 and it's um, 2003. And How fast does this sucker go? Uh, fast I've ever been was 175. And what CC engine is it? It's a thousand CC engine. All right. Any special mods or anything on it? Um, no special mods as of yet. Okay. And we're trying to lose the weight today, so we're going to extract this lead battery. Go ahead and show us to take it out, so we can show the folks at home just how easy this is. Okay, there goes the negative. Okay. Wow, how heavy is that? Say about I don't know. Five. It's about that's about <laughs> ten pounds. It's about ten pounds, yeah. I would say. At least. There's the size difference. <clears throat> Quite a bit. Alright. Throw that sucker in the boat. <laughs> Alright. Now this is a lithium battery from falconev.com aka lithiumracingbattery.com. This is a prototype but they're all worth day one, two, three cells so it all worked the same. This is our insulator around the positive terminal. So go ahead and hook those right up. That's the negative. Yep. <coughs> Don't drop it. Need me to help. There's a washer on there. Yeah, I got. Uh. Okay, on the other side. Okay. Yeah. Usually, washer goes on the nut side, but that's fine. Well, the hole in the. Put the washer on this side. The washer should go under the nut. Just so, uh, yeah, there we go, because the hole's a little bigger in the terminal. Get your screwdriver, okay. Do you need to put this, this, this goes on? No, top. I'll just do the accessories later. Okay. Maybe just make a point. Yeah, we're just hooking it up right now for testing. All right. Oh, it doesn't have any room here. I may have to bring that out over the top. Can we? I guess you can stick it in like that. Whatever. Just bend that down. However you want. Can this come out over this way, or give you a little more room to work? I can walk around it. All right, got it. Thank you. Okay, nice and tight. Then we're going to pull this over to insulate it. 
pull that up around there just to cover the positive. Slide it up there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Now, of course, as you see, we got some extra space around here. Later on, he'll put some padding around there to isolate it, uh, keep it from bouncing around. But for the most part, there's your installation on a hard wire. He's not going to be uh, pulling it out, uh, so we don't need any quick to quick disconnects. This is an 8 cell, a 1, 2, 3, 12 volt, 4.6 amp battery. So here we go, we're going to start it. Let's see what happens. Testing and talk to you later. Thank you.